right after seeing the difference between primary keys and indexes let's see how we how we can create indexes now and before I do that actually the explanation I, I, I used in my last video when I explained the difference between primary keys and indexes belongs to the someone by Denny Cherry uh, right now let's, let's see how we can create indexes now, we explained that we want to use establishment date now there's more than way of creating to create indexes through the command line or through the terminal the first way is to use the word create oh, I'm sorry to use the, the command to use the command create index so create is a keyword capital case index and then we give the index a name on which table we want you know our table name and then our column list we said that we can use more than one column if it's multiple columns then we specify them in a comma separated list otherwise we can use just a single column of course inside parentheses yes uh, we can say uh, create unique index and uh, and that will give us a unique index or we can use simple index the difference is that with a unique index uh, two rows will not have the same index value yes so no two rows can have the same index value whereas if I use if I do not use the, word, the, the the keyword unique that means I am having a simple index and with a simple index duplicate values are allowed in uh, our tables I hope that makes sense so let's go uh, to our uh, teams table and create a unique index on our establishment date and see what happens we'll copy and paste that and now it has been created remember that the index now we can't we won't be able to see it the user the I'm sorry the user will, will not be able to see it but whenever a select statement is, issue, is issued that table that table is used I'm, I'm sorry that index is used to uh, you know retrieve back the results and as we said before that and, and if you notice now the, the keyword unique there has been has been added to our table uh, description and that means we actually have now a unique index on that field on that column and as we said before whenever the select statement is issued the index is what gets loaded into memory and that speeds up the re you get getting back the result set much much uh, uh, better than, than just loading having to load the, the actual table in, in memory now we explained the alter command before and we can use it actually to maybe add primary key to our table and if you notice and that's, and that's the uh, just a quick revision on alter, alter keyword that's the syntax alter table table name and then we can add primary key before we just modified columns deleted columns added them modified the types but now we can add primary key and then we give a column list so our table here for example if you notice uh, our uh, if I just do show tables and then if I describe my fans table if you remember it doesn't actually have a primary key so we can add the primary key to it and use maybe let's say for example just for the sake of explaining things game ID so table name I'll say fans table yeah add primary key and then I'll say game ID if you notice you can see here that I don't have any primary keys yet I want to issue that and then describe table again I can see that a primary key has been created not only this but I can also use the alter uh, the alter command to actually add uh, indexes to my table so I just say alter table give my table name and then add unique if I want a unique index index name and then the column list similar you know not, not too far from using the create index statement and then if I want uh, uh, a simple index then I just don't use the word unique as you can see here alter table table name add index index name column let's do that quickly maybe with uh, with our uh, uh, fans table so I just say add alter table fans table and then add index and we will give our index a name let's say for example we'll name it uh, date index or something and then the column name is uh, you know let's say game date although you know we we start on these are duplicate I'm just using them for the sake of demonstration so let's create that and then describe the table and you can see now that 
uh, my game date now has been created as uh, a simple index and it's say mul there that means multiple it allows multiple uh, rows because it's simple index it allows multiple rows to be used rather than uh, having a single row for every index value and that's the case when we used the unique index if you see the previous table here it's telling me that establishment date is unique thanks for watching bye bye now